Hello everybody. Um, if you have or have bought some heart tools that Walmart sells and um, they're brand new and or you have any power tools that have been sitting for a while in storage or whatever and you go to charge them and plug them in and the light is just blinking and flashing when you charge it. Um, it's not broken. You don't need to buy a new battery. You don't need to return it. Um, you just need to jump, jump, jump start the battery. What the, these chargers will only charge the battery if they uh, are over a certain voltage. So I'm gonna show you my little setup, and uh, hopefully this helps somebody. All right. So basically, I just just a battery, positive, negative. You don't, you don't, you don't, you don't need the voltmeter, but you know. I do it just so I can know what's going on, but I just made a little jumper into a USB cord for just a regular cell phone charger, five volt, and uh, that's it. So when I first started, this was at 4.5. It's been about 20 minutes, 20 minutes, and now you can see it's functioning between 4.2 and you know. I mean, 4.5.2 and 5.5, 5.4. So you let that charge up till you know it gets about 30%, 40% maybe, hopefully. And uh, you should be able to plug it back into its normal charger and it should pick it up and charge like normal. The battery just needs a jump start. When it, when I got this battery, this, uh, this is for a blower, it's 40, 40 volts. And uh, I plugged it in. The light was just blinking. It's in testing mode. So I te so I tested it, and it was at three volts. So it had just been sitting for too long. So I'm gonna jump start it, and then uh, after this, I'll make a follow up video and show you guys that you know something. It's, it's pretty simple. So like I said, this jumper, little USB cable, little five volt power brick. Bada bing, bada boom. Thanks, guys.